Hi guys, welcome to Motivational Monday. And today's episode is awesome because it's something I believe in with my entire heart and my entire butt. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> I think I'm funnier. Like when there's no one to laugh, it's super awkward. Jen, laugh. <laughs> okay, thank you, thank you. So self-care, and I'm gonna tell you how um, I found out on this trip how important self-care really is. So for a solid four or five days, the humidity, everything, it was so hot here, my hair would just go like frizzy instantly. Um, I hadn't shaved my legs, and honestly, I was just feeling like super down, super depressed. I really missed home, and um, I was just not happy at all. And a simple, like I was missing the most basic steps in the morning that like make me have a successful happy day and it's self-care. So I'm gonna tell you guys my self-care ritual that I did when I woke up this morning and why it's helped me have a day like I am today. So this morning I got up still feeling kind of down. I go home tomorrow so I get to see my little baby tomorrow. I'm so excited. Um, but I knew that I couldn't have another day like I did yesterday. I needed to pull myself out of it. So I got up. That was step number one. I got up when I didn't want to. It was 6 a.m. Got up, chugged a glass of water. Got up, chugged water. Um, and then I meditated. I sat down um, by the pool and I meditated for 10 minutes. And I know a lot of people will say that they suck at meditation and they, they feel like they can't clear their mind. Guys, you're talking to a person whose brain runs at 5,000 miles per hour. Like, I am by no means good at meditation, but I still practice meditation. So I sat there for about seven or eight minutes. My mind would wander and then I'd bring myself back. Then I went upstairs and I was like, just because your makeup's gonna sweat off your face in five minutes doesn't mean you can't brush your hair, shower, and feel good. So I hopped in the shower, I shaved my legs, um, I shaved my armpits, even though I have them laser hair removal, shout out to the DePuri Clinic. Um, yeah, I just got ready. I did, I dry shampooed my hair because I don't wanna wash it because it's, I, don't, I never wash it guys, that's just a thing. And I felt good. I got into my bathing suit, I had done my meditation, I drank my water, um, and then I went out and I had a breakfast and I didn't look at my phone for work for about the first two, three hours of the morning. It was just me time. And now I've set my goals. So I have goals for when I go home, I'm gonna go see a counselor once a week to keep like, I need someone to like vent to do, like I need someone to talk to. So um, I think that's necessary. I'm gonna make sure that I get a hot yoga pass and I'm gonna slay my fitness game. So all my goals are set for when I go home and I just feel super, super on top of it. And I don't know if you guys realize how important your morning is to your entire day. If your alarm goes off, you're late for work, you have to rush, you can't get ready, you can't share, boom, you feel like absolute crap. How are you supposed to have a good day when you feel like crap, you don't feel good, you feel like garbage? Um, so simple steps in the morning um, for me are so important. Self-care is so important. So ladies, like getting up, brushing your hair, doing your hair, even when you don't want to, will make you feel so much better afterwards. Silly little small things that might not seem like anything will add up in the end. So my weekly challenge for you guys is self-care. Come up with a self-care ritual that works for you, whether it's getting up, meditating, hitting the gym, getting ready for work, but find a system that works for you and follow that system for the entire week. Self-care. Happy Motivational Monday. Have the best day of your life.